Google Data Analytics course is worth some dollars, but in this video, I'm going to show you how you can apply for financial aid and get yours for free so you can start your data analytics journey. And that is the best certificate you could have as a junior data analyst. So, here I am in my Google Chrome. So, I'll just open my Google Chrome and type Google. All right, Google Data. I've typed it before, so it's showing up. You can see the first one Google Data Analytics Certificate Coursera. So, any one of these you choose is gonna show up. So, I'm gonna click this, and you can see the first one that says Google Data Analytics Professional Certificate. Once I click on it, it's opening. It's opening. All right, so here is how my dashboard looks like and if you look here you will see that i am already enrolled that is because i have this offer already so but if you do not have this offer already you will see financial aid apply for financial aid so you click on this so once you click on that you will see this you know, dashboard open pop up you will see they said application can take up to 15 days to be reviewed and that is of course how long it can take and you just go click on continue to this application and as you can see I have 4 over 10 open applications so basically I have applied for 4 over 10 I think 10 is my slot you know I could apply up to 10 courses for free and I will get the certificate when I'm done learning so this professional certificate is a eight course series and I have only applied for four don't mind me lazy me but in this video I'm going to show you how to apply for yours with the remaining ones that are remaining so here is the one that I have applied foundations you can see data comma data everywhere so I will just go down now which course would you like to apply for I've applied for this one I've applied for this one I think they are all faded I need to apply right so I have the remaining four left so I could apply for the fifth one and I click next okay here yeah, I have this welcome back yes they know me of course I am logged in I'm logged in so you might as well try to log in you might as well try to sign up if this is your first time so yes welcome back make sure this information you enter on august 8 22 is up to date of course it's up to date so here are the few informations that i've entered before now education of course high school high school if you're a graduate you have options to choose um graduate see some some college college degree master advanced so your annual income you earn in annual income zero don't mind you can you can add any amount you earn but if you don't earn anything just put on your zero choose your currency wherever you are watching from employment status student so you also have options to choose other employment status uh, reason you applied for it you know so I'm interested in learning data analysis this led me to learn Microsoft Excel using it to analyze or visualize data so all these things are long stories that I use to apply for my own you could copy them or you do um, a different thing and make sure your words are up to 150 words so when you are done you check this you check this so you just tell them why you need the financial aid you click on next so yeah you have your second step to complete and you are good to go so just a few more questions how much can you pay for your selected course leave it at any amount you see it you could move it down this really does not matter but here is the original price for this particular one so you go down and complete the remaining one so how we use how will your selected course help you you know with your goals 
So fill up, fill this up and tell them fill this up and tell them how it will help you achieve your goals. So I will fill mine. I think I have um, a copy and paste. You know what I use for the other ones. Let me see if I can open it and fill it. Copy there and my. So I've copied my previous response. So I'm gonna paste it here. So you could tell them also how this course will help you achieve your goals. So yeah, I'm done with the second, you know, question and I'll just check those terms and conditions. So please type the following sentence. I agree to the terms and condition above. So What next I will do is to check this I am not a robot and review my application. So thanks for completing your application. This is the last place. If you need to make any edits, you do that and you have your background information, you have application and questions. You could make any editing here before you click on submit. Once you click on submit, this is gone, you know? It's gone. So I will click on submit. So success we have received your application but that's not all that's not all you need to do this for the eight courses so you go back you can read the information to see when they will get back to you so on 20th of august i'm expecting them to give me a feedback you know of course it should be a yes your application for financial aid has been approved so that's not all you go back I think there's an option to review here again so you go back and do that for the remaining seven courses you know I did for four now this is the fifth one go back do for the remaining seven courses look for that same course okay can me this are the courses I just started one I have so many courses I'm trying to finish up so go back and look for that same courses i think this is it google data analytics you know click on it again and also apply for financial aid so follow the same process and you do that for the remaining aid so you don't have any problem all you need to do is to copy and paste your previous response copy and paste your previous response as you can see here i only have six left you know six seven and eight left so quickly you could do that as well and finish up what you have started so you are on your way to becoming a data analyst kudos to you kudos to you kudos to you well done make sure you take this course it is the best thing you can ever do if you're starting your career as a data analyst so thank you so much for watching this is deborah i hope you enjoyed this video please give me a like subscription see you in my next video bye